Paul Zindel's The Pigman and Me is a young adult memoir that recounts his personal experience of writing his popular novel, The Pigman. The book serves as a companion piece to the original novel and provides insights into Zindel's creative process, as well as his own adolescent years. The memoir is divided into three parts. The first part explores Zindel's early life in Staten Island, New York, where he grew up in a dysfunctional family. Zindel's parents' marriage was troubled, and his father was an alcoholic who often subjected his family to emotional and physical abuse. Zindel himself struggled with social anxiety and felt like an outsider in his community. The second part of the memoir focuses on Zindel's adolescence and his involvement with the two central characters of The Pigman, John and Lorraine. Zindel explains that the novel was inspired by his own experiences befriending an elderly man, Angelo Pignati, who lived in his neighborhood. Zindel recounts his first meeting with Pignati and how the two quickly bonded over their mutual love of movies and music. Pignati became a surrogate grandfather figure to Zindel and introduced him to a world of art and culture that he had never experienced before. The final section of the memoir discusses the process of writing and publishing The Pigman. Zindel explains that the novel was initially rejected by numerous publishers before it was finally accepted by Harper and Rowe. Zindel recounts his excitement and nervousness about the book's publication and his surprise when it became a critical and commercial success. One of the central themes of The Pigman and Me is the power of friendship. Zindel's relationship with Pignati and his friendship with John and Lorraine in the novel highlight the importance of human connections in navigating the challenges of adolescence. Through his writing, Zindel encourages readers to value and nurture the relationships in their lives. Another important theme in the memoir is the idea of art as a means of escape. Zindel's love of movies and music provided him with a sense of joy and wonder that helped him cope with the difficulties of his home life. Similarly, the creative process of writing The Pigman allowed Zindel to process his own experiences and emotions, while also sharing his insights with a wider audience. Zindel's writing style is straightforward and conversational, with a focus on anecdote and detail. His memoir is filled with humorous and poignant moments that capture the complexities of adolescence and the struggles of growing up in a dysfunctional family. Zindel's descriptions of his neighborhood and the people he encounters are vivid and engaging, bringing the setting of the novel to life in a tangible way. In conclusion, The Pigman and Me is a compelling memoir that provides a fascinating glimpse into the life of Paul Zindel and the creative process behind his most famous work. Zindel's honest and reflective writing style, combined with his insights into the themes of friendship and art, make this book a must-read for fans of The Pigman and young adult literature more broadly.